Kamikaze talking with Matt about his leather mask. Hi, Matt. <laughs> you are so amusing. So uh -huh. tell me, <laughs> you were briefly mentioning what what came up with your idea for your leather mask. Um, a few months ago, I was on eBay and I bought some leather to see if I could make anything out of it. And so I made, I started making masks. And um, then I heard about this convention, so I bought a table and I came here. But the reason you are doing masks is because of your first love, which is puppeteering. Oh yeah, I uh, I sell masks so that I can fund my puppet show. It's called a trunk full of puppets, and it um, it's uh, uh, kind of like a parody of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, but using hand puppets. And uh, so so I designed a whole bunch of hand puppets and uh, made a, made a show of it. And I have now also a comic book that goes with it. Do you mind if I look at it right quick and you show me your sure, puppet? Sure, yeah, yeah. Who is this little fellow? This is, uh, this is the inspector. He's like a Sherlock Holmes type of a character. And he, um, I myself am a terrible puppeteer. But they, uh, you can like move his face around and have him make expressions. And what's also cool about them is that I make their... I used to be a dental technician when I was in college, and so I uh, I made all of their teeth for them the same way that you make prosthetic dentures. <laughs> I guess they're British. British, because their teeth are kind of not American. Yeah, he is, he is British. <laughs> it takes... It, it's, uh, it's, yeah, they're, yeah, he's British. He's now, can he do? For, uh, Scotland Yard, is it? Is that the place? Yeah. Can you do a little bit of his voice? Um... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so to also fund your puppet show, you have a comic book as well. It's called A Trunk Full of Puppets. With your two petulant Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde inspired characters. What I, um, when I was in college, um, I, on a full moons, I used to dress up as a, as a werewolf and run around in the woods behind my apartment. Um, and I just really got into stuff like that. And, uh, you know, so I, I like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. But, uh, yeah, I've not actually read the book. Um, but if somebody wants to see the play, your puppet show, are you in L.A.? Where are you? I live in Burbank. <laughs> And where is your little show going to be next? Are you online? Um, if somebody's not at Kamikaze and they want to order one of these beautifully intricate masks, it looks like you have everybody. Especially an homage of Bleach, whose season finale is coming up on Cartoon Network, as well as Scary Clown, Scary Rabbit. Pretty much scary is where you're going for. Well, this rabbit's adorable. Uh, <laughs> But it looks like if you want to order something from you, Matt, I could go to Maskethat. Maskethat. Here in the about like uh, Instagram and Facebook, and so my sister is gonna help me with that. That is very nice of your sister, because I have to say these are really cool, oh, and I'm a huge you. Venom fan, so <laughs> I love the look. So it's cool. I love the dental issue. I think somebody might need some braces. I don't know. <laughs> so the next time I'm thinking about getting a mask, I'm going to think of leather, and I'm going to think of mask. Mask effect. Excellent. Mask. <laughs>